If you guys are wondering where the snow is, I just found it. It's right there in that hole. It's just a rip pain. We'll get, we'll get through it. It's not going anywhere. That didn't go quite as planned, did it? There are skis. Yeah. <laughs> If you guys are wondering where the snow is, I just found it. It's right there in that hole. What's up guys? Welcome to today's video. We're got some pow park going on. Not enough snow to go chase the mountain. Can't really ride the trees and stuff. But enough to have a sick day in the park. So soft. Throw some tricks. I can't breathe. That was a lot of work. We got the ski dock here. Backflip and Benton. Today's gonna be sick, so let's get it. Hi daddy. You sure, Daddy? Yo, you. That was the. That just made my day. Okay. I'm fine. There's nothing wrong with that one. You're fine? Yeah. It didn't feel, it felt like a normal fall. Once you get to that level, you'll understand. That's that's a normal fall. I will never understand that. Love watching you. Watch yeah. that, watch your name. Rico. Rico, that's nice to meet you. So those little jumps, like we we're trying to get spray shots on them and all that stuff, but the impact of, they don't really have a landing, they're kind of flat landings. It killed my ribs that last time. So I'm not gonna hit those little jumps anymore today. We'll give those to Benton, he can have them. But uh, I really want to like clean up my seven today, my back seven, because the goal is to go back 10 this year. So we really need to buy, dial in our backside spins and something I'm guilty of is pre-spinning like super hardcore. So 
uh, what I'm trying to work on is as I approach the jump, instead of being here and throwing, I'm trying to be here and then throwing. So that's gonna give me more momentum. It's also holding my snowboard straight off the lip and then right as my, my back foot's about to go off, then throwing the trick, is a, it's very difficult. It's hard because spinning backside can be scary because you go backside. So a lot of people when they spin backside, pre-spin. So trying to eliminate the pre-spin, I know that's what I got to work on today. Soft landings, good jump to throw it on, speed's there, so let's keep hucking. There are skis in the landing. Yeah. <laughs> a good seven i'll watch the footage and critique from there we got to grab but bending over really hurts my ribs still and i fell three times and the last one really kind of hurt my ribs it's just rib pain we'll get we'll get through it. it's not going anywhere so the ribs hurting isn't going to stop our snowboarding and you know what else my ribs hurting is not going to stop Today's sticker shout out, we got Casey with the Ski Evolution sticker and the What A Nice Guy sticker on his helmet. Looking so sick. Dude, thank you so much for supporting the channel. Snag an Evolution sticker. Guys, if you want an Evolution sticker or any of the hoodies, t-shirts, long sleeves, we have ski versions of all of it. Uh, it's all linked in the description. If you do snag any of it, tag me on my Instagram and I'll give you guys gear and sticker shout outs. But also make sure you're following the Instagram. It's where I post a bunch of bonus extra content. If you're not following the Instagram, you're definitely missing out on some bonus content. So check out the Instagram. Tell me what you think. DM me on Instagram. I try to reply to you all, but I literally have like, I think 300 DMs behind right now. So anyways, follow the Instagram, bonus content. The stories are where it's at. And today's been fire. I'm still gonna throw sevens. Today's been so fun, despite certain falling. Yeah, we've, <laughs> we've taken some slams, but we're, we're, we're out here, we're learning. Guys, the ski dock's out of here. Thanks for filming, buddy. Yeah, Hossy awesome car, wherever you are, hit up yeah. the ski dock. I'm done throwing sevens for the day. Not because, like, I'm very happy with all of them I threw, landed one of them. I just think my rib is, like, really messing the whole thing up. So, why am I doing that? Last, and I cannonballed really hard the last time. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, want to yeah, say? Yeah, yeah, I just yeah, want to yeah. say, like, all of you that have hit me up to tune your gear over the last couple of years that have heard of me through the channel, um, I really appreciate the business, guys. Y'all have helped a dream come true, something I've been building for a long time. And I just want to say thank you from the bottom of my heart. Appreciate it, guys. Shout out to you guys. Dude, let's go. Yeah. He's rich now, by the way. <laughs> let's go heli skiing. Yeah. Hey, we, we should go heli skiing. Yeah. Oh, well, what? Maybe. What? Huh? Huh? Shh. Don't huh? tell huh? anyone. Yeah, so on the note of the seven, I think we're going to put it away for the day. I just, I have this wrap on my chest holding my ribs in and I feel like I'm lacking the snap and the, it's just, it's just not fully there. We got, we got a really good one today. I just feel like I'm hurting myself more every time I fall, but I'm, I feel like I'm getting more confident with the seven every time I throw it. So it's like, huh, I'm getting confident, but I'm also getting hurt. <laughs> oh, oh, he dipped. He didn't even say goodbye to me. Yeah, he said, say goodbye Aww. to Benton and that you suck, something like that. Aww. the ribs are really affecting me is quick motion so like on the rails I want to do like quick swap to front boards quick these things and like I don't feel like I have that right now after going 
going up the lift. I think we're good. We're gonna call it, the energies just kind of got sucked out of the day. That happens sometimes. It's like, so like my energy's low. I don't feel like hucking and chucking anymore. Benson's kind of feeling good too. Tomorrow's supposed to be a pow day. That's what I'm really excited for. Rest my body a little bit. Getting some pow ripping. And on the note of like it hurting, I'm sure you guys will be like, yo, take some days off. Don't, you don't have to rip. But I do. Cause like I love to snowboard. If I don't, if I'm not snowboarding, I took seven days off. It was, like it was the longest I took an off from snowboarding and it felt so weird and just, I gotta be out here. It's just what I do. Came out and hooked it and chucked it on those jumps. Keystone's jumps right now are money, so I, I feel really good coming out and just throwing seven, 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 even if I took a bunch to my butt. So, on that note, your trick might not be a back seven, it might be a front three, a 180. If you go out one day and you fall all the time, but you're working on that trick, like be stoked. You went out there, you put in that work. Not like it's gonna take thousands and thousands of throws of something to be a master at it if that makes sense like the thing that i'm so hyped on is like my half cab i did half cabs into on the first jump and then through back seven on the second jump all day today well my half cab feels like straight airing to me because i've now have done like a thousand of them so I'm, I'm so hyped on that and honestly guys so many people ask me like how to get better do you have any trick tips videos stuff like that the only way to get better at snowboarding is to actually like snowboard no to actually <laughs> snowboard and then yes taking taking slams there's a certain point you've got to risk your body, risk, got to go a little hard, push your body to another level. That slam to get that I took today eliminated so much fear away from that trick because that was worst case scenario. So now the, I, the bad thing happened. I don't have to worry about it again. You're the only person that thinks like that. <laughs> only person on the planet. So we're not going to listen to Ben Tenson. The other thing, too, about hucking the seven all day today, not a single fall from that seven hurt because the jumps are just so good. So when you have really good jumps, you almost don't have to worry about getting hurt in a way because the, the landings are so nice. So like not a single seven hurt today. It was just like a pre-existing injury got tired. So I didn't get this shot yesterday because of a uh, GoPro was in time-lapse mode, but I'm rocking this like, it's shifted down a little bit. But it's the bottom two ribs that are all jacked up. That is so relieving because you put it on nice and tight, it holds your ribs all night. Oh, been wearing this thing way too much too. I mean, not like I'm supposed to wear it, but it's nice when I'm not wearing it. All right, guys, the last thing I want to say is we're headed to Utah, the fourth through the eighth. I'm a little ahead on video still. I've just been making all those extra like how to videos and like five reasons not to go snowboard places and like. Just making extra videos so it's not just a vlog channel. There's also like snowboard content on here. And it just, it puts the trips ahead by like crazy amount of days. Like it's almost where I can make so many more videos than, than were the days allowed. Does that make sense? So maybe we'll do some like double video days. I don't know. That's kind of crazy. Maybe we'll post a video on the, on Wednesdays when we go live still. I don't know. I don't have a true answer to that solution, but I like making the resort review videos for you. I like making how-to videos for you guys, but I also go snowboard every day, so we're gonna make a vlog. At the end of the day, I'm editing a lot. We're making a lot of videos, and it's a good time. So if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. My goal is to help you become the best snowboarder as possible. I try to break down what I'm working on with my own riding, which hopefully can help you guys with your riding. But I, once again, I drop how-to videos, all stuff like that. And then if you like today's video, smash that like button. It helps the almighty YouTube algorithm, lets more people see these videos, which does help. And guys, I think we're finally gonna get some snow. And I'm so excited for that. So smash like for snow, because uh, I want a pow day. Like I'm dying for a powder day today. It, it'll it'll make my life. Not today. Powder day tomorrow. Anyways, with that team, my guys, thank you so much for starting with me and Benton today. And as always, thanks for watching. Keep evolving. We'll see you guys tomorrow.
with another video. I'm on top of the ocean, living like life ain't frozen, feeling my feet been chosen for something other than motion, yeah. Mama told me I'ma be somebody, I ain't never gonna need nobody, no, no.